G'day, g'day. Texan Ads here with you giving you a brief rundown on our one of our OG custom indicators yeah. that we've had uh, yeah. made up for a, a couple of years now. And the more times I come back to this indicator and play with these so many things you can do with it, it makes me realize how much uh, I love this indicator and, and how much I need to be using this, uh, this indicator. So let's get straight into it and show you how Unicon works. Uh, when you get your trade pack premium or trade pack Pro, this is included as a standard in both of those, and it really is X-ray vision for the markets, as the tagline says. So let's dive straight into it and show you how to use it in this brief UTG Unicon guide. You will see there are a lot of things here with Unicon, and you don't need to use all of them, but you will find each of them have their own unique benefits across any market. We're using Ethereum USDT here, but this works on Forex, works on crypto, any market you can think of, Unicon does work for it. So the first one you'll see here is called the Murray Channel. And this works on any time frame. So we'll dive into that one very quickly. And Murray channels are, are, are dynamic lines or dynamic pivot points that change with flowing price action. If you can kind of consider a Bollinger Band, it's similar to that in the sort of the sense that the top bands uh, are, are resistance, put it very, very simply, and the bottom bands are support. This median line being the yellow line uh, is one of the more significant levels because we trend above it. We typically are bullish, trend below it, typically bearish. But each of these lines will also represent particular pivot points as well. And you can see how they've been respected as either support or resistance, depending on whether we are trending below or above these, uh, these median lines here. So that's really, really cool. I love that because you can essentially well not let's not get get too into the weeds here but um you know you know when we are trending in the green that we are looking for potential bounces and when we're trending up in the red we are looking for potential resistance points with the exception of these parabolic runs that we see here but looking back in time you can see how well they are respected so that's the murray's channels on unicon next as we move along we get to the trend exhaustion tool so this is very much what uh, what it says that it is and these bars that we see represented here on the on the uh, the chart represent buyer exhaustion or seller exhaustion depending on where we are so these red lines the the darker the lines are the stronger the trend exhaustion is so we can see here on these major pivot points we've got very strong levels of trend exhaustion and as we get towards the bottom of these moves the chart starts to turn green indicating that we have seller exhaustion so a really cool tool there again works on all the time frames one of my favorites is the pivot channels so what these does is it looks at significant volumes within particular channels and then highlights the sort of the immediate channels and we can see how well that's been respected on eth back in the past as well um the the data sort of shows more immediate information. So if you want larger time frame trends, then you can see it on um, on all of these particular time frames as well. Love that one. Next, the confirmed trend and all trend reversal tools. Ads, do you want to explain these ones for the guys? Yeah, so the confirmed trend reversals is uh, Unicorn's uh, way of attempting to, not to pick, but uh, just to, to suggest where the top or the bottom of that trend will be. And then the uh, the all trend reversals will really give you uh, some s sort of swing targets in between that trend to, to really gauge where the pullback should be. So if you're looking at, a, at an uptrend starting at the, starting, you know, from, yeah, from the, uh, from the bottom there at uh, on the 13th, uh, we've got, and as you move up, then you've got uh, your, your, mid-range trend reversals and that that indicates there there should be a pullback in inside that trend uh before a potential movement up yeah absolutely and of course anything that comes with unicorn or any of the indicators that we create and share with you are obviously best used in conjunction with your own form of ta so they're not always going to be exactly what you're looking for but you definitely want to use them in conjunction with your own ta uh, and this one is a really cool tool adds as well the super trend stop loss do you want to explain that one yeah so the super trend super trend stop loss if you're in a let's say a position trade or even a swing trade over a long time frame even a smaller time frame um this will suggest where the stop loss is to be so you don't get stopped out of the market uh, prematurely before you know taking profit at the top or the bottom of a potential trend um, this can, yeah this can also be this can also be uh, modified with your stop position uh, 
counter there where it says 3.7 just in the middle of that uh, that those settings there and then you can change that to either bring it further away or closer to, to price depending on the asset you're trading 100 percent perfectly explained ads and then now we start getting to probably i would say probably the most used uh mm. ones of ours yeah. Um, being our EMA. So we've got our set to, the, the standard settings are here on the screen, but the 10 and the 20 EMAs, we back tested this and this is probably one of the best EMA crosses, uh, I guess signals if you want to call that. And one thing that we have here as well is our EMA cross signal. So you can look at the validity and sort of the accuracy of, of a, a basic EMA cross strategy, which Unicon gives you. You can fire alerts on all of these as well. Uh, and everything here inside the unicon indicator is completely customizable as well whether you want to change colors whether you want to turn maybe you want to turn the ema cross signal up for when it's bullish or when it's bearish you want to turn it down you want to change the colors of the slow and the fast emas your super trend longs and exits uh we also have in here a couple of little other goodies uh, as well which is the utg divergence indicator which comes along with this uh, so we've got we've got bearish divergence and we've got bullish divergence signals as well if you trade with your cci or your rsi you could use that in conjunction with one another uh, and i think for me the the um super trend exit which is uh, one that we haven't explained just very quickly as well, similar to what the EMA and the EMA cross is, but helps to give you where Unicon identifies as the top or the bottom of particular areas. So we can sort of see here as well, we've had a, a call back here on the 4th of January at around 134 bucks. And then the the second uh, or the, the next exit sort of indicator was around 246 again down here at 142 and we're still yet to experience a uh, a down signal if you want to call that for the super trend exit or entry indicator so that's unicon really in a nutshell everything customized uh, customizable you've got one two three four five six seven different indicators in one here it really is x-ray vision for the markets and it's included in your trade pack premium or trade pack pro for more information you can head over to unitytradinggroup.com and get your hands on this awesome awesome og indicator of ours you will absolutely love it thank you for watching and see you next time